Conserving water is the easiest set of projects you can do that will save you money and lower your impact on the environment. Now this is especially true for older homes that still have all the original fixtures. Today we're going to look at three different projects that are easy to do and have a big impact on water consumption. First, changing the aerators on your faucets. Second, changing your shower heads. And third, installing low flow toilets. For the faucets, it's not necessary to replace the entire unit. You just need to replace the aerators. Now you simply unscrew the old ones and screw on the new one. And make sure you do this throughout all the sinks in your house. The same thing goes for replacing your shower head. You simply unscrew the old one and screw on the new one. Now be sure not to over tighten it. These two things alone can reduce your water consumption by 15%. Okay, toilets. Toilets are the single biggest consumer of water in a typical home. And on average, a family of four flushes the toilet 15 times a day. Now that's about a thousand liters a week. The local water system, paid through your water bill and taxes, has to pump all of that water into the house and treat it after it leaves. So if we can reduce the amount of water that we use in the home, that makes for a stronger, more efficient system in place. We're installing two low flow toilet models here at Polymerisis, supplied by Water Matrix. Now this particular model is our dual flush toilet. Now as you can see, it has two buttons. Our larger button produces a six liter flush for solids and our smaller button produces a three and a half liter flush for liquids. Now as you might expect, the three and a half liter flush has less flushing power than our six liter flush. But that's not the case for the next toilet we'll be showing you, which is our ultra low flow toilet. This is our ultra low flow three liter toilet. Now what makes it so remarkable is the technology that it uses inside. It has a unique mechanism that uses trapped air to propel those three liters down to produce as much, if not more flushing power than our six liter dual flush toilet upstairs and their old 13 liter toilet they had before. So how much does all of this cost? Well, we installed four aerators at a cost of $3 each. We also installed two shower heads and they were about $75. Now two dual flush toilets were installed at a cost of $150 each and our ultra low flow three liter flush toilet was $200. Now, can you do these things yourself? Absolutely. There's a number of websites and tutorials online that can help you install a toilet. And the place that you buy your toilet will likely have a person that can explain you the process in detail. How long does it take? Well, the showers and the aerators will take about five to 10 minutes each. Now the toilets, about a half an hour to an hour, depending on how handy you are. Now, savings. Last year, Paul and Marissa paid just over $500 on their water bill. The changes that we've made will cut their water use by 50% which means that the low flow water fixtures we've installed will pay for themselves in three years time. The less we use, the lower the strain on the infrastructure and the environment. And we get a few extra bucks in our pocket. 